Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, The MK Lady. Well, that coach unboxing last night was just phenomenal. I waited so long, it was sitting on my shelf and I couldn't wait. It's springtime and I knew I wanted it for spring, so I ordered it way back then and it's been in its dust bag, not touched or anything. So today is the first day that I have been using it and I'm using it at home. I'm staying at home, I'm working from home, keeping my social distance, and I want to thank you for all watching my videos with me. It just is just so precious in a time like this that we can take our mind off of everything that's going on and have a little eye candy. So it is the Coach Rogue 25 in the color Peony. So this color, it's a very kind of, it's a bubblegum pink, but it's a, I think a shade of bubblegum pink, like a, more of a pastel -y pink, because I do, I did move my bags around and I do have a bubblegum pink up there that I wanna do a comparison with. So I have my stuff in here and the most times that I was carrying it around this morning I was carrying it on my shoulder just like this I'll show you that in a minute but I really do like the top handles the top handles that kind of is a must in my realm of handbags but I do have some shoulder bags like the coach tabby hobo, hobo. Um, but it's just, I love, love, love my top handles and the option for uh, shoulder. And I will show you in this video the crossbody. Now it's a little long for a crossbody, so I just absolutely love this color and I love the brass hardware. And it does come with a 1941 coach hang tag, which is oxblood on this color and then there is the horse and carriage right there on the hang tag it's quite a heavy hang tag and I think this one was supposed to have the little pochette like the little key but I don't know maybe it got lost in shipping I know it didn't get lost in my house because I haven't touched it so maybe it was a return but I don't care it still looks so beautiful but it is quite heavy and it's heavy because of the quality of the leather as you could see it's pebbled leather and the hardware even my arm is getting sore holding it up I think I need to work out actually it's so funny because my son is doing online training with some of his well online personal training with some of the kids that he trained in hockey before so you might hear some yelling around or some music in the background because he's going to be doing his um, online training with them. He's training them is what he's doing for hockey. So I gave my arm a little bit of a rest. That was just a little side note. So we'll go ahead and get right into this bag. I will tell you about my outfit of the day. So crochet is coming back in. This is a top I got last year from Winners and it does have like a little bit of a slip, but I threw a tank top on underneath because I didn't want it to totally see through everything. So we'll go ahead and get started. I do have these cute little earrings from Joe Fresh. I just think they're cute and adorable. So in terms of reference, I'm five, five and a half. Medium build, I was hoping I could fit this this shirt from last year because I did put on a few pounds from this isolation quarantine stuff because we eat a lot. So here it is on the shoulder. So this is kind of how I was walking around carrying and doing my business in the morning and I like it just like that. It's a really nice strap drop and you can pull your arm through and it doesn't really hit your elbow. Oops, excuse me for the bruise. I've been bumping into things lately. So the top handles are just like so. 
I think these could get in the way. Oopsie. Well, I'll take it off now <laughs> since it just popped off. So these are dog leash clips. As you can see right there, I'll just put them on the side. So this is what it looks like when you're carrying it around like this. So it's not a very big bag. I'll give you the dimensions and then we'll do the crossbody. So they have it, the Coach Tabby 25, it's called that, or not Coach Tabby, Coach Rogue 25, because it's 25 centimeters. And it is, oopsie, let me get this little thing right. So, yes, it's a uh, 10 centimeter, well, no, 9.5 centimeters across. And the depth, or sorry, the height is about eight. And then the depth, it's quite a thicker, roomier purse in the depth part, which is a five. So just know that that happens. And then, of course, these hardware and these thick, thick kind of zippers. I still have the plastic on the zippers and I'll just go ahead and attach it. So here's for the crossbody. I guess you just attach it like that, but it's kind of long for that. Uh, yeah, I guess you attach it like that and then we'll get these and then we'll crisscross it. So I have it on that side right there and then I'll put it down. Now it's structured right now with the pebble leather, but I have seen these get a little slouchy. It does have feet and it does have a reinforced bottom and it says the glove tan leather right there. But this is what it looks like as a long shoulder. So it's quite long as you can see, it goes like way below my hip area. But as a crossbody, I mean, it is, it is possible as a crossbody, but it, it's very, you know, five inches. So it's, it's quite thick, but it, it can be done as you could see, and then carry it on the back. But I have a feeling that if I do wear it like this as a crossbody, these little dog lips would get caught in the back of my hair there. So I'll just take off those straps and then I'll move this and we'll get into the inside of the bag. So I said this was microfiber yesterday, but it's not, it's actually suede. And some of my subscribers helped me figure this out. And it has these two deep pockets, which is perfect for keys or your phone and I can't find my phone. I must have left it actually. Where did I leave it? Oh, I probably left it in here. Yeah. So this is the bag, the Ava yesterday in the color rose. Let me put this phone down since I have it out. But this is the two colors. So this one in rose is a little darker. And here's the phone. We'll stay on track for once. So as you could see, these big side pockets, you could put keys, you could put other items, you can put a card case on both sides. So let's put this Ava back. Get into the inside of the bag. And even though it's that big, the inside with this canvas, kind of light lining here. There's a front slip pocket and then a zip pocket, but it is quite snug inside there. And I do have my wallet, my Ray-Bans, and also my wristlet and my card case, as you could see. So that is all I could fit in there because the inside right here is not very big. But I mean, you've got these two side pockets, but I'd be careful with this suede because you don't want to like rub it and get it all like gross and worn out. So 
I'd be careful putting it like if I did this. I mean, you could do that, but I would just mainly for me keep everything in the middle of the canvas coated or canvas lining. And then you know it's also more secure. And these zippers, let me tell you, these zippers are so buttery smooth, buttery soft, and they're so substantial that it is like such a quality bag. I don't know how I've missed this bag in the past. It's been out for years and I'm just finally getting on the Rogue Wagon, but oh my goodness. It is so, so pretty. I just absolutely love it. And I don't know if there'll be any more in the future for me. I mean, I do like some of the colors. I did see this on the outlet. I believe I bought this on the retail site when I was looking at my receipts. So that is the Coach Rogue. And there is this one, the Michael Kors Whitney, that is more of a like a bubblegum pink and I do believe this color is called this is the carnation color from last year so this is a little bit more pink than this pink so and then I, I showed you the rose color right there so so I think that is all I have for you today. I'm super happy. I love this Coach Rogue. It's such a beautiful bag. Also, please give this video a thumbs up because you know it helps me keep relevant in the YouTube world right now. Keeps my videos on the YouTube stream and when people search it, I will pop up with my videos. And it's just computers running Google offices, Google YouTube right now. So when you do give this video a thumbs up, it bumps it up in the ratings and it helps me. And we get to be together more and more. So that's all I have for you today. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, The MK Lady. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell because every time I upload a video, you will get notified. Have a great day. Bye.